Thanks, Chad and Rhea. I'm Stephen Human. Now, San Juan County, which is in the southeastern corner of Utah, is known for white and red rocks, very similar to the environment where you guys are right now. But there are some hidden gems that are incredibly different and incredibly beautiful, and I want to take you to one of them today. San Juan County is a place where extremists can rappel down a hundred foot cliffs or swim through deep slot canyons or experience how Native Americans lived thousands of years ago. Rock is what you tend to think of. This is a land that is easily accessible on Utah Highway 191 just south of Moab, but most local Westerners don't take the time to visit. We tend to only see it in pictures of Monument Valley or the occasional glance south from arches. But San Juan is so much more. Adventures on the Colorado River, views of epic scope, moments of inspiration that change the way you look at the world. What most people don't know about this area, however, is the lush forest that is just 15 miles from Blanding, Utah, an island of green in a sea of red. It's quite unique. We have the sandstone, the mountains, and the lots and lots of trees. And we go up to part of the trails over 10,500 feet high, and it's called the Shea Ridge Trail. Look over and see the Henry Mountains, the LaSalle Mountains. It's not really rough, it's just a nice ride. I've never been on an ATV run before, and I've targeted this one because of the timing and the area, and I've never been to Blanding, Utah before. Not everyone gets to experience the cool fall breeze or witness trees whipping by like watching a fast car zoom past city lights. But for the riders of the San Juan ATV Safari, this luscious fantasy becomes a beautiful reality. When you go through a campus of trees and the only thing that's there is the trail, it's beautiful. And you slow down and you see deer crossing the road or you stop in a meadow and you can see for miles. And it's just an experience that you can't get sitting at home in front of a TV or, or even in a book. In 2002, the ATV Safari was born. 10 years later, it has quadrupled the number of riders, as well as almost doubled the amount of trails that off-roaders of all ages can explore. Every fall, hundreds of off-roaders converge on Blanding for three days of new sights and sounds. The 18 different trails range from red rock, arches, trees, lakes, and everything else you can imagine. I like how you know it goes up and comes back around, so now I kind of knew, because at first I was like, I don't know where we're going, but then we ended up coming back down the same trail, and so a lot of fun. With once-in-a-lifetime views and mountain paths that are some of the best in the country, you wouldn't expect the safari guides to be any less than perfect. Even visitors who prefer to ride alone found the insights the guides provided into the history and locale to enhance the trip. The whole experience is, is unique, and having a guided tour that you could stop and see where it took 30 years to build a, a tunnel through a mountain and then stop and, and see for 30 miles and the guide says, see that point over there? That's Pistol Mountain or those type of things. You, you would never get that in a classroom. This is where it's at. Then there's some rock we have to go over that makes it four wheeling and that's what's enjoyable. Seeing the, and then uh, especially with taking the people and telling and explaining them and telling them the stories about the mining and the, the rides and what just what went on up here. All of the safari trails are open to the public year-round and can be ridden without guides. Maps and other info are available online at sanjuancounty.org. For safari participants, though, this has been a trip of a lifetime. But skilled guides, breathtaking scenery, and just the joy of hitting the trail aren't the only things that draw these riders to spend the day searching for adventure. Sometimes it's the people you bring with you that make the experience truly memorable. We're really close as a family. We do a lot of things as a family. To be able to have adult kids and have them with you and enjoy the experience is, is un, it's unexplainable. It's just a lot of fun. Being older than that, being the oldest, you know, I don't get to spend a whole lot of time with, you know, with my, with my parents, with family, because I have family of my own and working. So it's nice to step away from, you know, your reality a little bit and then just kind of relax and ride a four-wheeler and have fun. And spending a day with your family in an oasis like this can be the experience of a lifetime. Now, if you want more information on this area, on how you can join the safari next year, go to AYLTV.com. More importantly, you can go to SanJuanCounty.org and you can get information on the trails, on the ATV Jamboree, on everything in this area that you can experience. 
Well, for At Your Leisure, I'm Stephen Human. Now let's head back with Chad and Rhea with Four Corners Adventures.